Hi everybody. So yes, I am actually holding the camera this time. Um, I'm actually getting kind of annoyed because I got a package and I already started, got halfway through everything and then my camera cuts out on me. So, um, but I got my cloth pads and I'm going through them all. And so I guess I'm going to have to start all over again, but I have half of them unpacked. So, oops, sorry about that. So I have two wet bags. I'm going to try to do this quickly. I got two wet bags. I got a bird and this is really um this one's actually super soft this one's not so the super super soft and fuzzy one's going to be my dry bag so all of them that i'm going to use is going to be in this one and then my wet bag for when they're nasty and gross will be in this one so i just grab both of them and run to the bathroom that way you know they're little tiny bags they're not going to know what they are so my first size that i have unboxed is size eight so pretty much about these is uh, size eight. It's like for like when you just start lightly spotting. So, which for like my first maybe day and a half, I actually really really lightly spot, and I got ten inches, which are I actually got a couple of these. I already got this print, but it's an eight inch. I already got this print, but it's an eight inch as well. And this one's in ten. I got a cute butterfly one. Which I actually like that print a lot. I'm gonna have to probably get that in a wet bag for diapers. And I got my Jack Skellington one. I'm excited because I'm actually gonna be ordering a bunch of these ones and I think another pair. Also, great thing about the Jack Skellington ones, which I will show you right now. Plus diaper, same print. I need to get a couple of those because I love the Nightmare Before Christmas. Um, after. Yep, and then I have some really, really big ones, which actually is this size. This is 12 inches. And there's one more pair I'm gonna get, which is 14, which I'm actually gonna stock up on for after I have a new baby, but here's the pretty much the size comparison. My other ones are actually in the cloth diaper hamper, like that I use for the kids for their socks and underwear now, because now the, the kids aren't in their diapers anymore. Um, I just tossed them in there so that way I can wash them all because I used them as panty liners to test them out, make sure I wasn't allergic. Here's a size comparison, 8, 10, and 12, which means 14 is probably going to be like this long. So I'm actually going to be getting a whole bunch more of these. I have probably, probably almost, yeah, almost $150 worth of more cloth diapers is in my Amazon checkout bin. So I'm looking forward to to spend more money on bags <laughs> and I know in the long run I'm going to be saving a whole lot of money with these I got two more to actually unbox with you guys or unwrap with you guys because that stupid okay so here's this one I already got this print so I have this print in 8 which is upstairs 10 and 12 which here's the size comparison so it's pretty big there we go big wings which I know those ones are gonna come in handy for my really big like my bad heavy days because I don't like I look like I'm just dying through my underwear for like day three and four and then day five I slowly spot again it sucks okay here's this one I think I'm missing one. oh I am missing one So this one is a size 10 as well, and I actually have these in two prints, um, 10 to 12, and they're both those prints. So these are actually going to come in handy because I'm expecting my period actually on the very last day of February. It's supposed to come in the very last day of February, but we'll see how that how that goes. So I'm going to put. Okay, so I'm actually going to st start folding these bad boys up and getting them ready for my bag because I always want to be, you know, make sure that I have them. A lot of people probably think that these are gross and that's not sanitary. However, disposable ones are actually clogging up our landfills and stuff like that. So, by me going cloth, 
Yes, it's gross. Yes, I'll be touching my own yucky blood, but you do it anyways when you put it in a tampon. So it's really not that big of a deal. On top of that, I have a skin disease. Like legit, I have a skin disease. Um, my mom has it. My little sister has it. I have it. And, I'm, and sadly, Rain has it. Which means that if Tony and I do have another child, my if it's a little girl, it's got a 50-50 chance of having the same skin disease, which I hope not because I don't want them having to go through that as well. Alright, so. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. It says that these can hold 6 of them, so I'm going to fold up 6. Got my wet bag. And pretty much, I'm going to do it like this. I'm going to do my big one. A super big one, which I'm gonna probably fold in like this. Okay, it says it should hold six. We'll see if I'll do that. Looks like only four, but I'm gonna make it fit. So I'm gonna put this one in here. One. Yeah, right now it shows it can hold like pretty much five of them, and that's with the really, really big ones in there. Probably if I didn't have big ones, I could probably fit, fit two, six comfortably, but I'm going to put six in there, and just like this. Then I'm gonna zip it up, and then these will be for my. I'm gonna put in my bag, which I gotta clean out anyways, cause I gotta work tonight at six, or tonight at four. My bad. There we go. And it is, you can see, pretty thick. It's super fuzzy. So this is my dry bag, and then this one will go with me, and it'll be my wet bag. So I will more than likely take this one. Fold it up really teeny tiny like this. Oops. Like that. And I'm probably gonna just stick this right up in here. That way it's all together. And if I bust the seam well, I'm just gonna have to fix it myself. There we go. So I've got six of them in here. Plus I got my uh, my wet wet bag for when um, I have to change myself. So all of that fit in here. I am actually pleasantly surprised with how, with the size of these and with how they are. I'm actually really happy. So I've got three more left in here from my entire stash. So these are the three that I have left, which I'm going to snap together and put in my new period drawer, which in a couple months I will update you guys on that because why not? There's actually some people who are curious. So, here's those. Alright. <laughs> it's so skinny compared to the other one. <laughs> that's funny. Alright, so that's pretty much it. And I will see you guys later for another video. Soon. Bye!